Bossy splash down. We see main shoots cut. Nick, Alex, Butch, Sunny, on behalf of SpaceX, welcome home. Oh, a long-awaited welcome home. The long-delayed Starliner astronauts, Barry Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams are finally back on Earth after being in space for nine long months on a mission that was originally expected to last just eight days. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. This is what it looked like as the pair were taken out of the Dragon capsule. It is normal for them to be taken out on a stretcher as their bodies are brittle after being up in space for so long. And that's what CBS 8's Alex Cheney was learning more about today. Alex, you spoke with local experts about how Butch and Sonny will just to being back here on Earth. What did they tell you? Well, Marcella, they may be back on Earth, which is fantastic. However, the journey does continue. It's going to take physical therapy over several weeks for their bodies to readjust to the Earth's gravity. And splashdown, Crew 9 back on Earth. With this splash landing, astronauts Sonny Williams and Barry Wilmore finally ended their unexpected nine-month stay in space today. The space travelers launched last June 5th on a mission that was expected to last just eight days. Instead, mechanical issues with their Boeing Starliner spacecraft forced NASA to keep them on the station and bring the Starliner down, unmanned by remote control. The crew returned today on a SpaceX Dragon spacecraft. Back on Earth, their health journey is just beginning. They will be taken to the Johnson Space Center in Houston, Texas, where they will be checked over by medical experts. Long-duration missions in space take a toll on the body, from weaker bones and muscles to vision issues. They won't allow them to walk off. They'll put them in a stretcher of some kind, uh, but, uh, but they'll get back to it. I mean, it's, uh, it's just precautions. They don't want them to fall. You know, want to make sure their balance system is, because once again, they're not in weightless conditions. Jim Kidrick, the president and CEO of the San Diego Air and Space Museum, says astronauts Wilmore and Williams will undergo physical therapy over the next several weeks as their bodies readapt to the unfamiliar tug of gravity. It's probably going to take, you know, two to four weeks before they start feeling more and more comfortable, but it, the adjustment will actually be pretty quick. But the first priority for Butch and Sonny will be to see their families and friends. The 286-day-long trip to space is the sixth longest single space flight in NASA history. Reporting live, I'm Alex Cheney, CBS 8.